you shout. I hope all is well. A nightmare. nightmare. I've had this the third time I'm having this terrible dream. And I have a very strong feeling that something terrible is about to happen. Hey. Mm. What are you going to do about it? Mm. Who's that? I guess it's the other more. Does he come to the here this early? I don't know. There must be a cause for his visit. All right. Mm -hmm. Let me prepare and go and see him. Okay, now nah. your water. I've run your water. Thank you very much. Uh, your hot pot. Thank you. Let me go to the kitchen and prepare something to eat. All right. Iba, I greet you. Thank you. Iba, I sense calamity. Iba, I sense calamity. Iba, I sense calamity. Iba, I sense calamity. That is about to befall our kingdom. Now I know that truly you are the ear and eye and voice of the gods. I had a terrible nightmare, and what I've just said confirms my worst fears. I also had this drill about an impending calamity. So I agree with you now. What do we do to avert that calamity? You will. A fat sacrifice needs to be performed. I see. Yes. Shall be done. Shall be done. I think my name. All right. Father, don't tell me you're going to offer the sacrifice. Why not? Father is ridiculous. This man will practically finish the whole livestock in this village. And you know the most interesting part of it? It's not going to be enough for him. <laughs> Why do you think so? Can't you say it? I can. I can't say it. Father, open your eyes and you realize that this man is only whipping you off. Yes! I am doing what I can to ensure the survival of this kingdom, which incidentally is your own kingdom as well. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Emeka. Don't tell me that you are arguing with your father again. Ask him why he is trying to prevent me from offering the sacrifice that will save this kingdom from impending doom. I don't know why. So, He's what doing is that. your father talking about? Mother, is he not that Ezemo? Is he not that Ezemo or what you people call him? He's demanding that father will slaughter more animals for him. Hmm? So? I am doing whatever he recommends for the preservation of this kingdom, which incidentally is your yeah. own kingdom. Because you will take off to me. So what is wrong in that? Why wouldn't you want us to save our kingdom? Why? And Father, you think a mess lots of animals will prevent that? Mm -hmm. So what is he talking about? Emeka? Fine. I have heard you and what have you able. I'm just in my mind. God bless you.
Where are you going to? I'm going to the market to pick something. Ah, okay. What up, Papa? I hope he's in your house. No, he's off to the palace. Ah, okay. That, that reminds me. I hope you and SZT have settled with your friend. I mean, the priest. No, Mama. We are not yet in good talking terms. But though we are planning to meet him and resolve things. But we are scared he might pick offense with mm -mm. No, you can never say until you try. Eh? How much have I told you how I hate to see you, you people fighting here and there? Eh? Fight among yourselves. You people have been friends from childhood. If there is any problem, people should resolve it by yourselves. Eh? Please. And that's why you are late. Okay. Ah! Don't worry. Alright, we're here. Hmm? <laughs> we'll try. Hmm? My friends, allow them in. Hey, allow them in. Really, really missed you guys. I've been expecting you. 
Did you actually say I've been expecting us? Yes, of course. Are you not my friend? Oh, I see. So it's because of what happened the other time that you, you think I'm still angry with you? I am not. I'm forgiving you. Well, my prince, I'm really sorry for everything. Yeah. I apologize, okay? Okay, now, Ezech, let's forget about this. Okay. You guys are my friend. I hold no grudges against you. Yes, I'm sorry. No, forget it. Okay? I am okay with you. I don't have a problem with you. You know what? You guys are right on time. Why don't Todd just go inside and eat breakfast? It's ready. Yes, mommy's even inside. Everybody, my sisters. Let's go. What? <laughs> my God. <laughs> oh, Jenna. When once he wakes up in the morning, he brushes his teeth. Not even because... taking his baths. And he said, "This guy is such a bad boy." When I mean a bad, that word bad boy with capital letter. Really? If you're saying he's a bad boy, that makes all of you the same thing. Thank you. Remember the saying that goes, birds of the same feather flock together. Yeah. Come to think about it. Imagine my brother, Prince Ebeka, calling someone a bad boy. That's like a kettle calling for black. Please. Thank you, thank you very much, my princess. For that love for me. My Not for my son. It's not the boy. Mommy, you don't have to sound Hello, baby. Are you serious? Where exactly are you guys now? Wow. That's good. That means we should be expecting you. Yeah. You know what, baby? Baby, please, please drive carefully. You're very, very important to me, okay? Yeah, I'll be waiting. Yeah, I'll be waiting. Hello? <laughs> Mom, mm -hmm. the governor's daughter. Oh, your girlfriend. Yeah, I told you she'll be visiting this year with her friends. Yeah. They're on our way. I remember, I remember. Your sisters uh, will prepare something for them. Yes, of course, Mom. As a matter of fact, we're so excited. Susie's our friend, too. Yeah. Apart from the fact that someone wants to have her all to himself. No, I didn't hear that. You see her? Did she say that? <laughs> she did. No, no, no. This is a very big accusation. I can't take it. You know what? I have to contact my lawyer. Oh, don't worry. No, no, to I'm prove my innocence. Like, mommy, you know, you know, I don't take shit no, like that from no, anybody. I'm going to be mommy, I don't. No, 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 no. I can't. Your Highness, you mean the Ezemo demands the bigger sacrifice? Yes. Then there is something heavy. If that is what they meant, that means Ezemo must have seen something. And it is not something we handle with kid gloves. Mm -mm. Uh, it must be something terrible because going by the nightmares I've had recently, uh, it's something terrible and um, we just have to do something about it you know, to avoid the calamity. Hmm? If the gods demand sacrifice, we have nothing left on us. Let us offer it. We have no right to question their judgment. Mm, I am not really questioning the judgment of the gods. I'm only hoping sincerely that our sacrifice will be enough to appease them. That's, that's just my fear. So that we can permanently avert this calamity. Of course. It will appeal them. You see, because they have never fed us before. Um, if we remember, we will know that our New Year festival is around in a matter of days. Excellent. Um, so we will do everything possible to see that we have a wonderful celebration. You are right, Ichiobi. I'm even worried that this news is coming to us now that we are looking forward to having a big celebration. I, I sincerely hope it will work. Mm, I think it will work. I am giving you the assurance that everything will be put in place before the celebration commences. On our own part, I'll say let's just do what we ought to do to appease the gods. Like our people say, 
Nkita sisi tupulio, ora pulio kunyana ndemo. Talking about is she the same girl that was here last year? Yes, she is the same girl that was here in our New Year Festival last year. And guess what, guys? You know what? She is coming this particular year's home with her friends. Yeah? I mean, her beautiful friends. Yeah? That's nice. <laughs> our friends. What's what? that? Our friends. What's what's up with her friends? Eneka, did you see her father is now a governor? Yes, her father is now the governor of her states. Yes. Really? I swear to God. You know, he was he used to be a House of Assembly member. Yeah, he used to be. So he contested for the governorship election last year and um, he won it like six months. You understand? So I still find it very difficult to believe that my girlfriend Susie is now the governor's daughter. That's interesting. My guy! <laughs> I'm a lucky man. Nice one. I'm a nice lucky one there. Nice one there. <laughs> but uh are you not planning for any special events for her? Oh, about uh planning anything I've already have some things put in place for her. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. I've got an idea. Which is hunting. Hunting? Yeah. See, guys, why don't we go hunting? Imagine how she's gonna feel to know that I'm the person that went to the bush to hunt a bushmeat for her. She's gonna be excited. It's gonna be a surprise. What do you guys think? We are cool with it. Are you cool with it? Yeah. You sure? Are you cool with it, okay? Yeah. You sure you're cool with it? Mm. Okay, in that case, I have to go inside and dress to something kind of. Mm. Oh, uh, Maka, see, help me tell mom and dad that I'm going hunting with my friends. Hunting? Yeah. Why? I want to go and hunt a bushmeat for my girlfriend that is coming. So you tell mommy and dad. Do you have a problem with that? Thank you. Deliver my message. Alright guys, I'm coming, okay? Alright. Hush! Last time I checked, I don't remember begging you to come on this trip with me. So I would not take that for it. Now, it's okay, baby girl. Don't be like that. I was only joking. Come on. <laughs> Just go get some. Baby, right. Just go. I'll be fast about Please, that. Please. I'm talk. tired, yeah. I'm gonna be tired for what? Take your time, okay? You don't need to hurry up. Okay, whatever. Don't take your time like that. Just 
Very, very snappy. Thank you. Don't mind her. Take all your time. Emeka, why are you looking like this? What happened to you? My son, I need my son this morning, and that's all I need. Will you come back here? No way, I will not come back. I won't. He must surely tell me what happened to my son. He must surely provide my son today. All I need is nothing but my son, and that is all. Chima, Chima, Mama, what do you need to do to Papa? Oh, you don't know me again. You don't know me. I'm okay, nurse mother. No. Eh? I'm okay, nurse mother. Allow me to go see him. Calm down, calm down. Let me go. My son. Okay, now. Okay, now. Okay, now. My son. Now give my son. Okay. Okay, now. He went out of the Calm down. He This is serious. So what this girl was saying is that two of her friends were also attacked by the same monster. And according to her, one of them was a minister's daughter. Now, how do we explain this? Because a lot of questions will be asked to which we must provide answers. How do we explain this? Your Highness, I think what we should be concerned about now is how to get rid of these monsters. And I believe with that, we can face any question thrown at us. Igwe, I thought you've asked to see the village warriors. Why are they not here yet? Um, you know, they live in different places, so I believe they are all trying to assemble. Let's give them time. Yeah, they'll come. Certainly, they will come. Baby, I've sent some people to bring back your car. Can they also bring back Grace and Janet? Baby, come on. Take it easy on yourself. 
what happened was nobody's fault. Okay? Remember I lost two of my friends. You saw Ogena's mother there. She believes I killed her son. Why does she think you killed her son? I... I don't know. Maybe because... I just don't know. I don't know. You don't know? Susie? Susie, you have to go and eat something. Yeah, it's, it's something. Okay. I'm not hungry. I have to eat something, no matter how small. Can I borrow your phone? Call my dad.
so well, the rose is missing. Ofabu! What is happening? Ofabu! Let us say! Come back! Come back! what that thing is they are going to defeat it and come back here victorious sure there's no doubt about that but the part i don't understand is there's a more saying he has no idea of what that thing is is that that the gods are unaware of what that thing is you must see <laughs> what is the ordinary aunt Ordinary aunt. <laughs> Ordinary aunt. <laughs> what is this again? <laughs> hmm? When I teach them. Wogugu, Wogugu, e dam mili, e opun nanti e chirem, <hesitation> ambake ba wanya nuni ve, <hesitation> oye zako, okucha, e. Come again, come to see it again. Let me hear you. Whoop, 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 pause. Now you put your money. Hey, oh, Gugu, oh, Gugu. Oh, Gugu, hey.
yourself! If you're not afraid, show yourself now! I can see you people are already scared. And your people have such confidence on you. How can you save your line from my rot by being such cowards? Take a message to your people. I have come to wipe out every living thing in your land. Take my message to them. Fire him! Fire! <laughs> To do with this, Father, I know nothing about this monster. Baby, are you? What do you think you're doing? You don't trust me. I just suspect. I saw you holding on to this drawing when I barged into your room. How did you get it? How did it end up with you? I don't know anything. And what, I, what exactly are you driving at? Tell me. No, 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 no. Go ahead and answer her. How did it end up with you? You know I'm seriously suspecting you. How come that you are the only survivor amongst the three of you in, uh, in the forest attack? If you have no connection with the monsters, and you think your girlfriend may not be suspecting you? Emeka. Father. If there is something you know that we don't know, tell us now. What do you know about this monster? Father, I don't know anything. I swear to you. I don't know any... How come this one is different? You see, that's what I've been saying all night. You should have been there to observe what we went through. Determined. Elders, this one is different. Transforms into all sorts of things. Hmm. And anyway, your majesty, it also has a female voice. What? A female voice? Yes. I think I'm getting more confused as a female voice. What exactly are we talking about here? Help me if you can. As a female voice. As a more, what was it you were saying outside? That I had something to do with what? <sighs> you were... I want you to reflect on your past. Try and remember what transpired between you and the Kemma Iroka of Umwada clan. The Kemma Iroka of Umwada clan? I don't know what you're talking about. Great one. Are you talking about a Kemma? My sister, who disappeared mysteriously many years ago. Ichiruka, I am talking about your sister. Igwe has something to tell us concerning your sister's mysterious disappearance. Does she have anything to do with this? Igwe, Igwe Malezio, Akazo dea. Igwe try and reflect on your past. Tell us what happened to her. All right. I was in love with her. And the relationship lasted for. I am sorry, Father. She's my girlfriend. I, I didn't mean to get her pregnant. I know you don't intend to. That is why we have to have another woman outside the woman that's, that's been protecting you from turning away. Maybe that's why one of the ways you want to tarnish my good image in this kingdom. Father, how can you think of a thing like that? I mean, how can I think of tarnishing your image? I mean, what happened was just an, it was just an accident. Then, how do you intend to handle this matter? I love Ekema, and I'm, um, 
tired. I'm, I'm uh, what? Tired. I hope you are not trying to tell me that you will marry that again man instead of the woman that was betrothed to you. Instead of Ugoma. Huh? Let me tell you. That will never happen in this case. It will never happen. Unless you are not ready to take over the throne. Hey! Father! Of course I want to be the next king father. I want to take over from you when you're gone. In that case, we have to get rid of that pregnancy. And you make sure that nobody hears about it. Get that pregnancy terminated. But there's a problem, Father. What problem is that? The Kemar that I know will never terminate her pregnancy. She would rather die than to do a thing like that. In that case, I'll quit my own way. Okay. Okay. My prince, what have I done? What have I done wrong? You've done everything wrong by thinking that you can entrap my son with pregnancy. My son has been betrothed to the woman who is going to be the next queen of this kingdom. My original plan is to kill you. But my kind hearted son pleaded for your life. That we spare your life and kill the baby after you have been delivered. No. That is why you will stay here until you are delivered of the baby. And you keep it a secret from everybody out there. Nobody should hear about it. It's only after you have delivered. That will be free to go, but not until you have taken an oath never to reveal it to anybody. What? My king! Are you saying that I'm going to be here until I deliver? You should thank my son for keeping you alive till now. No. Dad! No, my prince. No. Dad! You will. My prince, please. Take out. Please. My prince, please, go ahead and do this to me. Your majesty, please. My prince, look up. What is it? It's my sister, Kemal. I don't know. She's not been seen since last night that she went to market. You know she's your friend. Please, have you seen her anywhere? I have not seen her Kemal for the past three days. Just hold it. Does that mean that she's missing? That's what it seems. Oh my god. This is not happening. God. Okay. Do you know what we'll do right now? Go back home. I'll take it up from here. Okay. Just go. Okay.
It was not my intention to kill her, no. I even left the baby in the forest and ran away. So which one of them is haunting me now? The, the other one is the man you were killed to sell his secret. The evil spirit of Ender Forest possessed his body and has now given him the privilege to take his revenge. Is that to say that we are all doomed? <sighs> Great one, is there nothing we can do to handle the situation? Like to appease the angry spirit? Is there nothing we can do? My prince, absolutely nothing. Because the gods are silent. Ah. You will. So you actually know something about my sister's disappearance all this while? And you kept the secret to yourself, you will. You will. Hey! There is... is the one that killed your sister that went magically missing 28 years ago that was what he confessed today at the palace if not for the SM war I'm sure he would have taken that secret to his grave it's a murderer and he should pay for it that's the problem who is going to make him answer for it I mean who is going to punish him he is the Igwe he has the power and he has the money so there's nothing I can do to him. Father, are you trying to say that the monster has been pointing the Ida Forest is your sister's daughter? According to his own. And it's not going to stop at that until the entire kingdom is wiped away. May the gods forbid. It is Igwe and his household that should be wiped away. That is true. I mean, why does everyone have to be involved? Why? Chema, my son. The Igwe represents this kingdom in the spiritual realm. So whenever the goddess comes to visit Igwe for his atrocity, the whole kingdom is affected. Nah, are you saying Ezemo said he cannot do anything to stop her? Absolutely nothing. Like something has to be done. Something has to be done. <laughs> You vicious son of man! You think you can do anything because of the little power bestowed on you? Well, I told you to enjoy it while it lasted. But now, the end has come because I am going to destroy you! <laughs> what makes you think you can destroy me? By the way, why do you take delight in destroying things around you? Does not, that doesn't make you a princess, no? How dare you? How dare you talk back at me? How dare you? What? Tell me it is the same nightmare again. This one is much worse. I made a mistake sometime. I always knew it would come and haunt me someday, but I never knew it would affect my people. Now, we all make mistakes now. 
eh? you I everybody eh? be strong for us now there's no mistake without solution you see there are mistakes you make that haunt you all through your life I committed a crime and because of that the princess of Ida River has me under her control she exacts influence over me I am totally weak I sincerely hope that when she decides to exact her revenge, it will not affect my people. I alone committed the crime. No. All the same, be strong for us. Oh? Shall come to pass before. No? I've heard you. Bring me my cola nut for my morning libation. Okay, no. I'm a good man. Your Majesty, this is getting out of hand, and we need to do something as quickly as possible. It should be. Everyone knows now, every one of us knows that we must do something. Eh? But the question is, what do we do? What do we do? We all heard the Ezemwadi, only I, and in the mouthpiece of our gods, when he said that there is nothing we can do them. Uh, which them? We are no longer talking about the monsters that have taken over the Ada forest. We can as well abandon the Ada forest for them. I think our concern now should be how to get rid of Ida Miri Python that is blocking the road that connects us with other villages. And not just blocking the road, it has already devoured two of our men area before taking that position. You see that? It cannot remain like that. We have to do something and get it out of that way. Igwe, Igwe, Igwe. Your Majesty, Uncle Naba, there is fire on the mountain. What is it? It's a wine miller has taken another tour and has devoured two of our men this morning. Well, that is what we are talking before you walked in. Oh, so you people have heard? Mm, yeah. So, what solution have you people come up with? What other solution do you want? If I are at war right now. You must have heard of the recent developments. What do we do? The situation calls for sacrifice. A sacrifice must be made. You can handle it.
Okay, honey. Oh, that would be very nice. Thank you so much. Yes. We'll be here until they arrive before we leave, yes. Of course she's coming with me. Okay. Okay, though. You take care of yourself, okay? I love you too. Bye. <coughs> mom, mom. That was, that was that? Yes, though. What did he say? He has promised to send some policemen. And I told him we would be here until they arrive. That's, that's very good. Um, Mom, you said we? Of course you are coming with me. Uh, I'm not coming with you. Don't tell me you're planning to remain here. Mom, I can't leave Emeka behind. He needs me most now. My mind won't be at rest if I abandon him in this village. Susie, you asked me to come and take you. And that's why I'm here. I was only calling out to Dad's attention so that he can see what can be done for this land. That's all. By the way, Mom, what about Janet's parents? How did they take the news of her death and Gracie's parents? Did Susie, you your dad asked me to return with you. Are you going to disobey him? Your Highness, this is the head of the rescue team my husband sent to help combat the situation. Who is taking them to the forest? I will take them there. You will what? Excuse me, after all you went through in that forest, you want to go back there? Baby, just to take them there, there's no big deal. There's big deal. Emeka, you're not going anywhere. Yes. Father. You heard your mother. You're staying back. Your Excellency, I will arrange for people to take them to the forest. It's all right. Baby, you don't need to worry yourself about me. I'll be fine. I can take care of myself. Okay? My most concern is for you to leave this village in good health. That's all I want. My mind won't be at rest knowing you are in this turbulent land. It won't be. Baby, you don't need to get yourself worked up over nothing. As you can see, the situation is being handled. I am not going to the forex again. I am staying here. 
You promise? I promise you. Forest alone? I thought the guy is going to us. This is where he's meant to accompany us. So we'll go the rest. Excuse me. Are you saying that we'll go to this thick forest all alone? Yes. No backup? Definitely no backup. Now let's go. Time is against let's us. Let's go, let's go.
saw something. What did you see? I don't know. But I'm sure I saw something. Cobra, shut up! I put it to you that you did not see anything. You are just imagining it. I know you're not believing Now the show must go on. Let's go. Retired voluntarily before them. It's not too late. What do you think you are doing? I quit. Huh? Let him go. Where is he going? Leave him. Sir, Commander, what is the next thing? Sir, but we, but we are few in number now, sir. Come from Maxwell! 
getting scared. Where did those zombies come from? You don't need to ask. We are in their territory. This is an evil forest. We are dead people. We are true. I'm buried of old. Alright? They are trying to protect their territory. And I want that in Mr. Commander, we didn't bargain for this. We came here to fight, fight the monsters. And now we're still sweating eyes. I suggest we go back. No! Don't go back! We are not going back! We are here to kill those monsters! And we shall do that! Not going back! Commander, we have lost three of our warriors already. I wonder who's next. No retreating! No retreating! We have to protect the lives of our people! Those monsters are still out there! And we shall find them! And yes. kill them! Yes. Get it! Yes, Commander! Get it! Yes, Commander! Yes. Commander says! No going back. So yes, we go not. Okay. The compass says that. Let's go. Weka! Weka! Thank you. 
My prince, what are you doing here? So it's you. Yes, my prince. You should be in your room. Ah, I think I saw something. Something? Yeah, a shadow. Where? Now we come here. I saw something and um, I think we've got a company. You understand? But what you do is stay here, keep watch. All right? Ah. Make sure nobody passes here. Am I understood? Okay, my prince. Okay. As soon as it's daybreak. That is if we survive the night. Why don't we leave now? I mean, it's not too late for us to save our lives. Mm -hmm. Do you think you can trace your way out of this forest if you're left again? You don't even know how deep you have fallen into this forest. That is true, that is true, Sha, but what do we do now? Don't tell me where I was sleeping. I couldn't sleep. I was thinking about you. Is that what you are? Not at all. I was awake. I was also thinking about you. How are you? I was going to you. I am not fine, baby. You should know. I just wish I was still with you. Has there been any updates? I mean, the police and the warriors. Not at all, baby. There's no new deaths. I'm afraid they may be all dead. Baby, don't say that. You don't think those men are able to defeat the monsters? Maybe I won't be home next with you. I don't think so. They're just out there to trace me. All the same, I have to keep praying for them. 
and um, the leader will come back. Yeah, that's a nice thing to say. I am praying for the land, and I know that by the special grace of God, all of this will be over. I hope so. I really, really hope so, baby. Now that I've heard your voice, I think I can still me. You don't want to say something. I really, really love you for the most part of my heart. I can't wait for this to be over so you and I can get married and be together for life. I love you too. She gets me sleep now. And sweet tricks. I'll call you back in the morning. Alright? Under monster, sir. John! Now, let's get out of this place. Sir, does it mean we are going home from here? Rubbish. Let's get out of this evil forest first. Yes, sir. Let's go! Commander, where is Commander? He's not here. Obiora, where is Otega? Uh, where? Are, are you sure the, the, the monsters did not take him last night? That's not possible. So where is he? Where is he then? Ibe, in the barns, but no singer and a rala chan kuakea. 
But I found myself licking my elbow with my tongue. Ah! He will. No progress report yet. And I heard that we have lost three great warriors already. That's the report I got this early morning, he will. I sincerely hope this situation does not defeat our warriors. We're gonna pick it up, pick it up. My prince, please where you off to. What kind of nonsense question is that? Will you open that gate? I'm sorry, my prince. We have Igwe Express order not to let you go out from this compound without his permission. What sort of rubbish? I am, am I not a prisoner in my father's compound? Can you open that gate? I say open that gate. I'm sorry, my prince, but that's an order. What? What sort of rubbish? Come on, move that way. Wait, this way. Why did you allow the prince to leave the palace? 
Your Majesty, we are sorry. We tried to stop him, but you have appalled us and escaped. What do you mean he have appalled you? He had a gun. And where did he tell you he was going to? Where did he tell you he was going to? To the forest, Your Majesty. To the forest? And you are still here? Go and bring him back. Look, if you don't come here with the prince, I'll have your head cut off. Come and get out. So why would the uh, guards allow uh, Emeka to leave the palace without permission? For what? But Mo, you know how stubborn Emeka can be sometimes? They simply can stop him. Meaning, are these guards supposed to be guards or cowards? Just give me a break. Mo, well, Emeka has his name. Oh, 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 he is and comes back any time he chooses. Oh, God. I just pray something. Oh, God, something bad. He just does anything he likes. Take this thing out of here. Please. Yes, As you can see, I'm in a very pensive mood. I hope you have brought me news to gladden my heart. Igwe, I'm sorry. I can't be very stubborn news. Aweke, 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 Naka. Our warriors just killed a young man, and the mother is enraged. Hmm. Hmm. I need to go over one hour. What is the implication? You go. When you put a pan in water, you see what I carry on in it. Hmm. What are you going to do if you go? You go. The wrath of Ezema is going to descend on us heavily. My son just left for the forest. Asa! Asa! Ha! I'm not asking no Jesus to cast you on the dali. Be not to go off. If you shouldn't have allowed the prince to leave, it was a mistake on your side. Ha! Asa! Hmm. I'm not moving. Pull on your jeans, you go. But. Something has to be done about it. Something must be done about it.
Listen guys, I I don't understand what happened down there. Okay, I don't understand. Does it mean that the waker is gone? They thought we killed that spirit. Yes, huh? yes we did. <laughs> and that was why that thing happened. I think it was the little goddess we killed and the mother was enraged. Listen guys, that's a good development on our own side. If we can kill one spirit out there, that means we can kill every other spirit. I thought they were invisible. Come on, be courageous. But, Commander, we are outnumbered. What do you mean by we are outnumbered? Well, we've lost a lot of brave warriors. That I agree. But that does not mean we are inferior. We are not. This should be an encouragement to us to fight harder. So that the death of our past brave warriors will not be in vain. Listen. We are into this together. And we shall fight. Fight and eliminate every other spirit out there. So I want you guys to be courageous. Okay? Be courageous. Let us do this for our kingdom. I guess we have to rest here for a while before we proceed.
No, let's go for it. Run it yeah. Yo, yeah. 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 Somebody help me! Somebody get me out of here! God! Help me! Somebody help me! Help me out of this ditch! Somebody help me! <laughs> There's no point shouting because no one can hear you. Who are you? Where is the other god? The monster attacked us and Chibuza was killed. What? Now what about my son? Your Majesty, we searched for him everywhere, but we couldn't find him. You are sure you searched everywhere for him? Yes, Your Majesty. To fire. Hey. I doubt if we will make it out of this forest alive. Will you shut up? Fire. Shut up, let me think. Fire, I can't believe you have a woman appearance. And you're even such God's beautiful creature. Who exactly are you? I don't think that question is necessary. For you already know who I am. I believe you must have been too. Are you the daughter of the woman my father impregnated and abandoned so many years ago? With that single act of his, he has set up this generation for total extinction. As we speak now, the queen mother is in your life, taking revenge for one of her daughters who has just been murdered by your warriors. Together, we will tear down your father's kingdom. Burn down every living thing in it to ashes and establish our own kingdom. How do you intend to do that? By the way, how did you get those kids in here? Just like I was abandoned by your beast of a father at birth, so were these kids abandoned by their different mothers. I have been taking care of them since years now. With them, my kingdom shall be established. But they're just for in there. They can't even make up a clan in the next generation. I have 26 of them down the portal. We will make up a village in two days. Mm. 
We must have to get out of here as soon as possible. Let's go. So where are we heading to? Just follow me. Oh, all right. You sent for me. I did. Please sit down. Yeah. Another terrible news. News? Yes, I just received a report. The very big snake is out there in the village destroying lives and property. Snake and more. Snake? How come knife? I don't know. I guess this must be what the Ezemon meant when he said that uh, the Ezemwa and Mili will visit us for killing her daughter. Hey. I sincerely hope that this snake has not swallowed all our warriors and policemen inside that forest. I must tell you the truth, I'm scared. Hi. I'm scared. Because this situation is getting out of hand and quite honestly I don't know how to handle it. Hello, Princess. Hi. How are you? Yes, I'm, I'm, I'm very well. Thank you. Please, I've been trying to get across to my prince and his lines are switched off. Please, can you put me through to him? Thank you. What? He did what? You people allowed him? From what you just told me now, I came to understand that this whole idea of revenge on my father was yours. Revenge is just a choice, but not an option. So why do you make such choice? Can't you forgive? I am not familiar with that word. All my heart craves now is revenge. And I will stop at nothing until I burn down every living thing in that land of yours. So why are you still keeping me alive? You ought to have killed me by now. Because I want you to live and witness the downfall of your father's kingdom. Then I will grant you the grace of being the last to die. Enough! My kids are hungry. I need to get them something to eat.
everywhere. Must be calm for more than an hour now. That is strange, isn't it? That's very strange. And I strongly believe that the monsters are scared of us after killing that mermaid. And have run for their lives. Or they are planning something more dangerous. I sincerely don't know why Prince Omega has to go to that forest. Why? I mean, why would he do... What if something bad happens to him, eh? I blame myself. I blame myself. Perhaps, just perhaps, if, if I were there with him, he wouldn't have gone there. You may be right. But that guy seems to be very stubborn. Well, there's nothing you can do about it. The deed has been done. Wait a minute. Okay. I think I can actually do something. Like what? I'm thinking of traveling to his village. No, you can't do that. You know that's going to kill you. And how is dad and mom going to know if you promise me you won't tell them? You know I can't promise you that. Why not? I can definitely do anything for you, but not encouraging you to embark on a suicide mission. Immediately you step out of this place, I'm gonna tell you that I swear. Linda! Linda, you have to. I'm thinking you can escape. Save that strength because you'll be needing it soon. I don't get it. Are you just a possessed human or a spirit being? Because I won't understand. You look so calm and harmless. I still find it very difficult to believe you're that, that fearful monster that's killing people out there. Did I say anything you don't like? It is time. Time for what? I will bring you updates as soon as we are done for the night. For now, enjoy your stay.
Somebody help me! Somebody help me! Somebody help me! Is there anybody there? Somebody help me! Is there anybody there? I can't believe we are about to spend another night in, in this Akos forest. Huh? If I had known we were embarking on this uh, suicide mission, I would have covertly written my, my will at home. Me too. Me too. I didn't even tell my family I'm, I'm embarking on a deadly mission. I didn't tell them. I didn't tell them. Yes, yeah, sir. I don't think it's a human voice. Perhaps the monster is setting a trap for us. Yes, and it's going to get us. What? We are going straight away to trace that voice. Yeah. What? Sir, I can't. It's a trap. Now let's go. the great warriors of Israel and Kingdom. Identify yourself! Now! Inspector Joe from the State Police Command. We have come to save the ugly situation that has befallen your land.
So, Inspector, how long have you been in this forest? It's not easy. We, we've been here for a day. Actually, it was a, a voice that attracted us to this point. Did you guys scream? <laughs> scream? We don't scream anymore. We've gone through hell in this forest. Torment. So we don't scream. Listen. We responded to the same voice. That's why we're here. That means there's a top party in this forest. We're ready to crush any other voice. Let's go! Let's go! Come on! My prince, what happened? How did you get yourself here? Oh, I'm Indigo. The, the monster girl captured me. What? Yes. You mean this is the monster's cave? Yes, this is where the monster lives. My goodness. Then we must hurry and leave before she comes back. What of the, the babies? Do you need to go with them? No worry, I'll come back for the babies. Let's go.
Thank you. Yeah. Oh my God. So what about uh, Susan? What's the meaning of this? Susie dropped it in her room. She went to that haunted village. Let me see. <laughs> What type of child is this? What did she go there to do again? And what if something terrible happens to her? Oh my God. I've been called the traditional law of that land this afternoon. And he told me how terrible things are there. You see? They've not even heard from the policemen I sent to them. That is the land Susie left for. I'm sick and tired of her mischief. Anyway. She is responsible to anything that happens to her in that land. Don't ever involve me. Help me out of that. It 
is filled with strange things. It is filled with strange demons. It is filled with monsters that eat human flesh. The succulent blood. Ida. Ida. Forest. Father, Nika is here. Good evening, Your Majesty. You're welcome. Where did you find the idiot? We rescued him in the forest, Your Majesty. Thank you very much. Uh, Your Majesty, the palace guards have to uh, keep watch over the palace while we go into the town and see how we can save more lives because these monsters are everywhere. Yes, Your Majesty. I agree with Ortega. We just have to go. The monsters are everywhere. I believe our presence there will make a difference. Right. I agree with you entirely. You have my permission. And may the gods protect you. He said. Oh God, I think I should go with them. Just mm -hmm. let me get angry with you. Uh, Prince, you just don't worry, okay? You need a rest, alright? While we go. We have to leave now, Your Majesty. Thank you. Otega. Yeah. Be careful, my guy. Oh, boy. I'll be good.
I summoned you people because I met with the Ezemo and we had a conversation. You shouldn't have granted it that. I know. We have hit them where it pains the most. And now, they are asking for a negotiation. I told him what it would cost him. And he said he would see me tomorrow's morning. So, let us stay mute. But, should they fail to meet up with our demands, we will strike back with full force. Let us go. Your Highness, we suffered a lot of damages last night. Not less than 100 people were destroyed by these monsters. Properties, buildings, all gone, destroyed. And the most disturbing aspect is that these vampires are not done yet. I have a feeling that they are coming back to suck more blood. Of course, they will. Ortega, I know that you met with the Ezen more yesterday. What did he tell you? Yes, Your Highness. He said he'll be coming to see you this morning. Then why isn't he here yet? Ibe, Ibe, I greet you. You check him as a more, you are aware that a lot of damage has been inflicted on our people. I am sure you must have conferred with the gods. Our Igwe, remember, our Igwe cost it. 
they should be prepared to end it. Is you a worker? Is you a worker? Mind what you say. You are talking to the king. He inflicted this on us. Joker, sit down. Now. This land. You should be the one deciding who to be sacrificed and not the other way around. Father, we do not accept this. No. Mother, mother, I love you. That's why I'm doing this. We have to do this for the people we love. If we don't do this, the entire kingdom, including you and my sisters, will be finished. 
would you choose to do this? What it cost it? It's a virtue to understand. Understand what you can make huh? You and your father are so insensitive. You're just heartless. Nani, yeah? you people have to kill me first, though. Don't you understand? Because they are the daddy. Because they are it's okay. It's all right, you see. I am the head of this family. I do not desire to die. For the gods have decreed. If by sacrificing ourselves, the community will be redeemed, then so be it. So be it. Is that what you are telling me, Dad? Why, why am I even talking to, to you? I knew it. I knew you were not going to listen to me. I knew you were not going to listen to me. Why am I here? Of his swallow came up. Today is a remarkable day. A memorable day in the history of our country. A day we all shall remember. A day we shall always remember as a remarkable day. The bravery and heroism of our India. Yubwe Ahamefna Ojemba, the fifth of this kingdom. And his son, Prince Nemeka Ojemba. They lay down their lives to rid us of the calamities that has befallen us. Their will always be remembered and appreciated. We will. Let us proceed. Hey! That will not be necessary! The one thing you cry is here to set this man free. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. And who are you, Ibadan? Me and the servants of the Most High God. Hmm. His name is Jesus Christ. You are nothing but a stranger. 
You know nothing about this land. How dare you come to interfere in our affairs? Leave before you receive it all. You may be right. I don't know anything about this land, but he that sent me knows everything about this land. Who sent you? Tell me who sent you? His name is Jehovah Jireh. His name is Jehovah Mekatiski. His name is Alpha and Omega. He is the originator. He is the creator of the heaven and the earth. He is the foundation and the founder of this land. You are a liar. You are insane! Hmm. No! I say none is greater than Okuku. None ever! And none is above Okuku! Okuku is powerless to the Almighty God whom we serve. Did you say that you are God, the Alpha and Omega, that is more powerful than Okuku? Yes! Igwe Ojemba and the people of Iswana. From today, this land is free from every calamity. From today, you are free! And that is in me! He that is in me is greater than he that is in the world! Yes! Oh. Yes! Some are afraid of what they are facing. They are afraid of Uh, you said that the God you serve mandated you specifically to come and liberate us from the shackles of Satan. Uh, Satan is not a problem. It says in one, Ida Miri, for a long time now we've been groaning under her tyranny, liberating us from her, the part of your mandate. But what are they doing in there? I don't like the way the whole things are going on. I remember. If it's the one descend on us, <laughs> we are doomed. Trust me. By the way, who caught that pastor? Who caught him to this land? Eh? My elders, let him come out and face the consequences of his action. Yes. Yeah. Pastor or no pastor, he must face the music. Yes. Look, it's it it's Let's take it easy. Let's just take it easy. Let me read you a passage from the Bible. Second Chronicles 7 verse 14. If my people, which are called by my name, shall humble themselves and pray and seek my face, and turn from their wicked ways, then will I hear from heaven, and will forgive their sin, and will heal their land. Can you explain that to us? It simply means that if you surrender yourself to Jesus Christ and obey him, as you are only Lord and Savior, He will set you free from every problem. Well, you have heard him. What do you say? No, no, no. Hmm? Okay. Sounds progressive. Yeah. What do you think? My entire household has decided unanimously to accept your God as our Lord and Master. Hallelujah. So lead us to Him. Um, Igwe, before that, I would like somebody to lead me 
where the Ezemai and her demons lives. All right. Emeka, I think this is your domain. You know the route to that place. So I will see you people off. And then you take him to the place. Why are you disturbing my rest? And why has the sacrifice not been offered by now? As a one, I came to bring to your notice that they are not ready with the sacrifice. As a one, they have submitted to a strange power. A strange man came from nowhere and started talking about a God. I don't know what he's talking about. I just don't know what he's talking about. I, then I would destroy them all. I will destroy them! I'm 
Lord, I command you to come out in the name of Jesus. Receive fire in Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Hallelujah. Our Lord is good. You are healed. You are delivered in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glorify the Lord. Thank you. Yes. Hallelujah. 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 You are delivered. What happened to me? What am I doing here? Why am I like this? Hallelujah. Why are you feeling me? Hallelujah! Amen! 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 Thank you, dear Prince. Come over here. Come over. Come over. Hallelujah. She is your sister. Take her home. What about the kids you told me about? Yeah, in here. In here? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Jesus Christ. I'm going to see the card. The card is in the bar. The card is in the bar. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Mary Bucano, Namido, 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 Mary